the fifth ending that we um, can get, the fifth alternate ending, sixth ending if you're counting the original one I got, has to do with Lucy in much um, the same way as uh, we did with Dectora previously. Now, I believe that Dectora's endings are only possible if she is uh, a replicant. If the game generates her as human, I don't think it's possible to run off with her. But uh, Lucy, I do believe you can actually get her endings regardless of whether she's human or a replicant. But if she is um, a replicant, I believe you may want to let the um, cook live. The... Uh, what was his name? Zubin, yeah. You may want to let Zubin live if Lucy is a replicant, if you want to get that ending. Because I don't think she will trust you if you kill Zubin. Fortunately for me, Lucy is not a replicant in my game. Which I know because of how this particular part played out when I tried to give her the test. If she is a replicant and you try to give her the Void Kampf test, I believe she will try to flee through the Hall of Mirrors and then get killed by Crystal at the other end. That only happened to me once though, so I'm not entirely sure uh, if that always happens if she's a replicant. Usually when I play, um, Lucy ends up being human for some reason. I did also make sure that I did not scare Crazy Legs off by drawing my gun there in this ending, same as with Dectora. So that's the only difference uh, so far from the main Let's Play. Otherwise, up to the point that we talk to Lucy, it is the same. I've been looking for you. Please, leave me alone. Father told me to watch out for you. I'm not gonna hurt you. Have you always lived on Terra? Yes. Father told me he thought Terra would be so special and beautiful. Birds and flowers and trees and blue water. But it's not like that at all. I don't remember it ever being like that. And uh, much like with um, Dectora, we can warn Lucy about Crystal. There's another hunter after your family. We know. The woman who smokes. You've got to get out of here. You're not... You're not the hunter anymore? Go, quickly. Thank you. Now, at first glance, this doesn't seem very different, but uh, it will make a difference later on. I do not believe that it makes any difference how you deal with um, Dectora in uh, this case, because if you've befriended Lucy, I think the game will always pick her over Dectora, even if you've also befriended Dectora. But I'm not sure about that, so if you want to make sure that uh, you get the Lucy endings, you might want to kill Dectora, just in case. If you've befriended Lucy at the arcade, she will show up during Act 4 when you head for um, Animoid Row. For example, when you're picking up the bottle of booze for the bum in the sewers. I have on occasion had difficulty getting her to show up. Um, if she doesn't show up, well, then basically bad luck, you won't be able to get this ending. So let's hope that this time she will. I told you to stay hidden. I can't stay there anymore. I don't want to be with father, not when he's so angry. Besides, I need something. We don't have time for an... That thing you do to see if a person is human? The Void Comp? You want it. Is it always right? Usually. Give it to me. Father won't tell me anything anymore. Is that why he was angry? Because you asked him? You deserve it. You know how this works? I set up situations and you respond. Okay. Is it hard? Like a test in school? No. 
sometimes it can be disturbing. Are you ready? Uh-huh. Right, so we get to VK, Lucy, who it seems is beginning to doubt whether or not she's a replicant. Hopefully, the Void Kampf will uh, give us an answer to that. Reaction time is a factor in this, so please pay attention. Where do you live? In Chinatown, at the Yukon. I think this is also the uh, first and only time in the game when we Void Kampf someone who actually wants to take the test. What do you do for a living? I used to work for Mr. Runciter until what happened. What's your name? Lucy Devlin. All right, that's got the calibration taken care of. Let's start with some questions. Are you taking any drugs? Just antibiotics. Well, that first response seems to indicate she's human. Also, I don't think that's what McCoy meant when he said drugs. Out of the corner of your eye, you see a large black spider crawling up the wall. I take care of it. Keep it safe. Seems pretty clear to me so far. When did you stop beating your spouse? I'm not married. And I never... Oh, I see. It's a game. Like you said. Right. It's kind of a stupid question to ask of a 13-year-old. What's the most embarrassing thing that ever happened to you? I don't want to tell you. It's okay. We don't have to do this. Yes, we do. Then you should tell him if you want to do this. You're giving a speech to a crowd of hundreds. First, one person starts to laugh. He leans over and says something to the people around him. Soon, the whole audience is roaring with laughter and pointing at you. I'd leave. I don't like to be laughed at. Nobody does. I'd try to find out what they were laughing about. Your child comes home with a black eye. I want children, but I can't. Can't what? Have them, or pretend to have them. Well, I don't know. If you are actually human, as this test seems to be saying, I don't see any reason why you can't. You're going to die. It may be soon. Death. The grave. Rot. It may be soon. The readouts don't lie. You're scared. Don't worry. I won't tell anyone. You're cruel. It's just part of the test. Oh. I should have known. Hmm. You're at a restaurant with friends. One of them orders lobster. The chef drops the lobster into the tub of boiling water while you watch. Why would my friends take me there? They're not really friends, are they? No, they're hypothetical people made up by whoever wrote the questions for this test. Of course they're not really friends. You see a documentary about 20th century tuna boats. At the end, you feel like taking up fishing. I couldn't do that. Positive result. Subject is human. Test terminated. The test says you're human. Really? Why didn't father tell me? Maybe he wanted to keep his family together. I'm not a little girl anymore. It's not fair. No, but it's understandable. I'm going to stay with you. Don't you understand? It's not safe. There's a hunter out here. If she finds out where you are... Can't you come back with me? Now's not a good time. It's never a good time. Listen. You have to be patient. You have to trust me. It's not safe here. Part of the reason why it's not safe here is these giant rats. <laughs> Which probably would have attacked me if it weren't for the fact that I was holding a conversation with Lucy. This... This whole uh, path kind of weirds me out, to be honest, because Lucy's 13, for Christ's sake. Anyway, after this has happened, you are pretty much committed to um, getting a phone call from Lucy, as we'll see. At the start of Act 5, you will find um, Maggie dead as usual. And like I said, Lucy should be calling. 
pick up. I... I didn't think you were going to answer. Sorry, but I... I was just... sleeping. What's going on? Father wants to meet you. He said he's sorry about everything he did, but he was afraid you'd leave the other hunter to them. Where is he now? Out in the Kipple, by the moon bus. Way out, where the tunnel ends. Tell him to stay where he is, until I can find a way for all of us to escape. But... I thought we were going away together. Just you and me. Maybe we'll do it after I talk to him. You promise? We could buy a car, from that place next to the arcade. A ground car wouldn't get us too far. One of those flying cars would, though. It could take us all the way out to that beautiful lake. You know, the one with the trees and the flowers. Lucy, there's a good chance... I'll meet you there, okay? At the place where he sells the cars. Wait, Lucy! Oh, I love you so much, Ray. Okay, I'm not entirely sure how to respond to that. Because Lucy is actually human in um, my game, you cannot go to um, Clovis and have her be there. If Lucy has generated a replicant, uh, you can still befriend her, and then, just like what happened with Dectora, you can get an ending where you go to Clovis at the moon bus, and then Lucy will be there and say the same line that Dectora said, this time the memories will be our own. But that won't happen if Lucy is human. I can still go to, uh, to the moon bus, but Lucy uh, won't be there and I will get the same ending that I will get during the uh, normal Let's Play. Which, uh, of course, uh, you've already seen. So, instead, I'm going to head over to the used car lot and run off with Lucy. Like Dectora, Lucy will be waiting outside the uh, used car lot. And the scene will play out much the same way as it did with uh, Dectora. But for completeness sake, I will still show you it. I knew you'd come. I promised you, didn't I? Father wanted me to stay with him. But when I told him I was going with you, he gave us his blessing. He's an extraordinary guy. I know. You gonna miss him? Of course. But now that I have you, everything will be all right, won't it? Sure it will. Promise me that we're going to find that special place. The one with the trees and the flowers and the beautiful clear lake. It exists somewhere. It's so much more than a dream, isn't it? It's where we were always meant to be. And we'll be there, together. Right. I don't think it exists. How's it going, Ray? Wait a minute, I thought you was going to arrest her. You don't get paid the big bucks to think crazy. Any of your spinners up and running? Uh, sure, got one up on the roof. A real beaut ain't a cheap ride, though, I'll tell you right now. I gotta take it for a test drive. Ray, I, I always liked you. True, I hardly know you. You seem like a stand-up guy. Eventually, when this fiasco is all over and done with, I, I know you'll get me on the come, right? You're a stand-up guy, crazy. That I am. It want me to tell your friend where you're going? Friend? You know, the doll with the cigarette. She told me you were in trouble and she wanted to help. What should I tell her? Ray. You tell her we're headed south. 10-4. I'm scared, Ray. Crystal ain't gonna let up until we're both six feet under. Ray! What? Evening, Slim. Thanks for bringing her here. It makes my end a hell of a lot easier. You're the coldest person I've ever seen when it comes to killing. I'll take that as a compliment. How did it feel to kill an innocent animal? Wake up, Slim. The mutt was a replicant, just like its master. Bullshit. You're more confused than the damn dog was when I pulled the plug. She was real, Steel. No two ways about it. Nobody gives a damn. All three of you will be nothing but a memory anyhow. And I'll be a rich lady. Ah! Oh. <coughs> nice shot there, Slim. You couldn't leave well enough alone. I'll 
see you again real soon. <laughs> oh, I forgot. You reps don't have a soul. So, pretty much the same as uh, before. And of course, you can still let. Uh, let Crystal kill Lucy and run off by herself. Similar as with Tectora. I don't know if you noticed, by the way, the reason this spinner doesn't work is because Crystal shoots it and breaks it somehow. Can you get it working? Ah, we'll have to find something else. Maybe a ground car. So, of course, we go downstairs. It's all over, McCoy. You got nowhere to go and no hostages. You got two minutes. Then we're gonna clear you out! I won't let them shoot us down like that! Where'd you get that bomb? I stole it from Sadiq! We can die together! The only thing we'll feel is the love we have for each other! I refuse Dear to God. go out that way! We have no other choice! We've got to! Wait a minute. We're right on top of the old subway system. But they'll follow us! Not if we can get a ground car down there. Hell, we can drive right through that tunnel and disappear! What if it's collapsed? It's worth a shot. Yep. Let me try to get the floor open. Arm that thing, all right? But wait for my signal before you drop it in. Now! Why does... Crazy Legs even have a crane capable of lowering a car into the sewers. Come oh. on, they'll be coming through the door any second. And off we go. I knew we'd make it. Are you ready? Yes, I am. I didn't know where we were going, and I didn't much care. away from the city first, and then as far as this heap could take us. And Clovis still dies. Actually, note that if Lucy is a replicant, you'll get similar dialogue here as we got with uh, Dectora about uh, the DNA information and how long she might live. But since she's a human, obviously that does not apply. This has got to be the weirdest ending. I mean, Ray McCoy ends up running off with a 13 year old scarcely dressed girl. It's the pedophile ending, basically. It's ridiculous. I mean, Lucy obviously has this kind of weird teenage crush on Ray, which, I mean, considering the circumstances, I can't really blame her for that, but it's not really a good basis for a, a long-lasting relationship. What is just bizarre is that McCoy would ever consider actually going along with this whole thing. But apparently he does. Yeah. I don't know. This ending is not my thing. Obviously. But there are still more endings.